Hey everybody and welcome back to episode 7 of my Let's Play Minecraft OP World. So I did go through, <coughs> wow yay, puberty. <laughs> I did go through and find a bunch of diamond as you can tell. I like, this is how I usually mine ever since I started, like you know, I just, I just like sorting it all out kind of thing, you know, just where you can see it. You can ask uh, some of the people, Paul, from my old channel when I first started playing he remembered uh, I was joining him playing and he came down into my mine shop that I had and everything was like this so yeah uh, like I said I bring you guys back when I found some diamonds and I already found a couple more like that so well it was it didn't, doesn't look like that but I made it look like that and I need to eat also crap don't have any food on me I will Instead of going straight up, I want to try to make some IC2 stuff and get all that stuff that I need going. Like the actual uh, da -da 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 -da. generators and all that, so I can get the uh, axe. I want to go to the nether so I can get some build or uh, what do you call it? Equivalent exchange stuff going. And I think I had one more ready for me to dig. But once I get all that going, from there on out, it'll just be getting everything else. Yes, I did extend this back some. Put up a chest. That's what we needed right here was our food. So let's eat up real quick. Ah, yeah, I had to wet my whistle. And we only have one left. Crap. Okay. So... That's pretty much it. I did want to show you guys that I'm going to be making a diamond pickaxe. Considering this has taken forever and I'm going for a lot of diamond anyways. Why not? You know? Okay, so. Besides that, we are up to six diamonds after that. And a whole bunch of other crap. Got this gold. This gold will be useful for say when I get my transmutation table to switch it out because four bars equals one diamond come on there we go this is annoying me just sitting there like that and you know what I think it's down here see how much better it is when you can run yep there it is more diamond and redstone and nickelite I believe it is so we're cutting all this Redstone will need a lot. Oh, nice. There's some silver or tin. Sorry. We'll need redstone for making batteries and all that. Nicolay, I have no clue what it does right now. So it is just it's just there, pretty much. And yeah, the one thing I do need to find is pretty much copper. I am very low on it. As you can see, I only had. What was it? It was three on me, and then I had three in the sh uh, chest, so I'm at like a grand total of six. And I need those to even make an immense, uh... Uh-oh. What's this? I found a... Don't tell me it's just going to be a little tiny s circle biome thing. Ah, but we found my water I need. Now all I need to do is find some lava. What is this? Is this tungsten? This stuff is really valuable. Yes, it is. It's 16,000. That's a lot of M, uh, EMC. So it looks like we ran into a little uh, gold mine here, it looks like. Got some iron. Some more of those. But, like, right now, like, I have enough diamond to do what I need to. I believe. I'm sure I got five. There's six, and that's 11. Yeah, I believe I have enough. But I'll get more, obviously. But what I really need is some copper so I can get everything else going. So I will set out and I'll bring you back when I find more diamond or once I start this if I just don't get any more diamond. Okay, well, <laughs> this is a little off or awkward. I went down to where the, I started where for the very first part right here. Went one over because so I'm trying to find that copper. And then I remember that there was gold down here. It was right here, 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 and here. Pick that up, 
kept going because I turned on as you can there on the map I turned on caves for the uh, map you can click your M and then the render type that's the surface and you see the biome like what kind of biomes there are and then caves all cave systems that it can see or that you've seen these are all the tunnels I've built Let's just make this huge here and then right in front of me I was like wait a minute that looks like a pretty big cave and I see right down there I almost hit a ravine down there too so that's a lot easier than it. but this is what really got me where is he I didn't change the difficulty there were two creepers coming right after me they were right up here I don't trust creepers great I turn it on to show you guys and they are nowhere to be found ah there's one of them there's a skeleton back there No, 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 no. Hoo What's up? Get you. Yes, and I did see the chest over here. Die. Put him on the right side so no which way he goes back. And yeah. Okay, now, since we do, we did find a little cave system here. We're gonna rob all of its resources. That, that's you know that's what we are we're borrowers right yeah okay now ooh. uranium coal oh shit another one and another creeper you gotta be shitting me that jackass okay, let's get this out quick before something else pops up on me Okay, is there some kind of bread or something in here? No, cocoa beans, of course. No, 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 no. Oh, shit. <laughs> Don't want to lose this. This is uh, research material here for dumb crap. For some badass items. Go. Very nice. Ooh, we did get some bread. That's only gonna give me two. Oh no. Guess I was a little wrong. Well, how do you cook make cookies? Ah. Uh, you can change the color of the metal oh metal. Okay. That makes sense, it's not the original planks so let's see what else we can find in here real quick see if I die a horrible funny ass death or lame death pretty much what's that oh Come on, don't tell me that's nope whoa 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 dude whoa holy sh shit monkey Okay, he can suck on his arrow. Ooh, yeah, that's not right. We're going to go back down there and kick this guy in the head. Okay, here we go. We're getting back in here and we're going to smack this guy up. I made a ruby sword because it should be better than my iron one I had. Wow, see, I hate how it throws all my stuff. That is annoying. I wasn't really too worried about getting back here in time, considering it's like maybe a minute walk. But, uh. Yeah, let's move this stuff over real quick. It's only a minute walk, and your items on the ground last for five minutes. 
unless you have some kind of mob where you just change the default. I love when you hit these that light up. Those are rubies. I'll try. Okay, okay, okay. Let's get back here for a second. Let's regroup. Let's recuperate. Okay, now I brought some wood along with us for some twitches. This should help out. Grab some more real quick. Cause I did plan on all those being used. So it looks like, yeah, this one's just a small little tiny thing here. I hear running water. Oh wow, see on the thing it's opening up more. Oh wow, okay, yeah, we're gonna go back this way for now. Hmm. Shit, shit, shit. Get some more of these so I have a shit ton of torches. Should have just grabbed all my wood and brought it with me. Come on, get thank you. Yes, copper. And lava. That's just one source of it. Well, I need a pull. Which there probably is one somewhere around here. Nice. Got a big fat chunk of copper here. Okay, so with this. There we go, now it has some little safety spot. We have some more Lepus Zuzui here. We need that for blue electricity or blue electricity or whatever the hell it's pronounced. All I know is it's badass. Make a lap pack and everything. Nice, okay, we have some more. We got water over here. Sweet. So we're just gonna cut all this out. And after I get this, I'm going to go back and see if that lava leads to a pool or anything. And up. Holy shit, let's go. I don't think it does. I think that that's yeah, just a one source block. Hmm. Shit. Okay then. Well, since we got that, we're going to go back this way. And see what's actually out here. Oh shit, donkey! Gotta keep the XP going. Wow, resources up the ass. Very nice. That's too close. Yes, I am very picky with them, just considering I really don't have any. So, nice, some sapphires, emeralds. These are very nice to have when substituting for other stuff. Get all this iron, all of it, need all of it. Since you, I will fly through iron. It's ridiculous of how fast you go through it. And if you don't use equivalent exchange as much as you you know as it would allow you to yeah oh here a zombie and a skeleton shit nope there he is there's a zombie Ooh, nice. That was a skull. I don't think that was a zombie brain. I need zombie brains. Wait. That was... Yeah, destroyed skull. Crap. Oh, shit! You son of a bitch! 
You suck. Where'd you come from? Up here? Oh, that dirty asshole. Okay, well, while that does that, I'm gonna get this iron. Hopefully I live with everything I get. <laughs> okay, there we go. Well, let's head up here because I see copper and everything else. Jeez, this is a nice little cave. Boom! There we go. Get these down here. You see, this is weird. I've never ran into a point to where I had to actually go out and find copper. Well, after using a shit ton of it. Okay, well, that looks like all there is for that. We'll just ride the Pony Express down. Come on, thank you. And I will see you guys on the bottom. I'm going to head over to the next little cave part I saw, and we're going to explore that real quick. And I actually uh, don't know why I went all the way over there and was looking around everything. When the cave I was in, I already had pools of lava everywhere. So what I did come back here real quick to do was to make um, a bucket so I could carry the water. And I smelted down some of the tan, and I'm going to smelt down some of this iron as well. Just so I can speed up the process when we go up top. And when we're down here and everything else, just by making those ahead of time. And also making them into... actual iron furnaces that's that's the main point right there the iron furnaces will make everything way faster because they burn 25 percent less so what we are doing is looking for water source which that'll just be easier to get this one over here probably a little safer as well There it is. So, grab this. Fill this all in real quick because there's no use for it. And yeah, that's about it. We're gonna go back. We're gonna mine out some obsidian. Show you guys how that is real quick. Back down here. That's why I picked this one better. I mean, there's a pool right next to where I spawn, but this is just a little better and I would like to make a path over to there but I'm just gonna extinguish this just so my stuff is safe to so say you just put water onto lava it has to be still lava if it's running then it makes cobblestone so got that light this up and now let's gonna make ourselves a little pathway I was going to put up my torches down there. Knew it. Okay, well then. See, I don't know what that popping sound is. Is that or if it's the actual, like, mobs or something? Okay, so. The easiest way to do it is just to set your water source somewhere. Make sure it's flowing in all in the right directions. There we go. There we go. Yeah. Okay, sweet. And remember, only a diamond block can fix the, or break these. So pretty much all you're doing is just going at it. It takes a while even with it. You can't see the cracks really in this, but you want the water to flow above it just so it does that. You won't lose your item, the drop itself, and it's just a constant thing. So you can just keep mining. It does that, and then we jump down here and pick up our two pieces. So what we need total to make everything is I believe it's 14 10 to enter the nether and then we need 4 to make the actual transmutation table and then we'll need one extra after that to teach it because that once once you learn these 
you actually have to teach your table all the items or it doesn't know it you could you know want to make diamonds but if you don't have a diamond to teach it how to make diamonds then it doesn't know how much EMC it's worth or that it's even conceivable but once you destroy it you can pick you know once you learn it you can pick it up and move it anywhere you want so there's that as long as it doesn't like fall in lava or some shit you know then you're perfectly fine so with this instead of trying to get all of them to get into the nether that's my first objective is all I need is one two three four one two three four five six seven eight I need eight because I'm just gonna use the floor to make the uh, the bottom two and normally a nether portal would take you fourteen pieces all I need is ten because you don't have to do the very corners of them just the three on both sides and the two on the top so it's three six and then you got eight ten so there's eight right there so we can effectively go in there and there we're gonna grab our water source here who's over here Ooh, this leads into that cave very nice okay cool well We'll check that out in a little bit. <laughs> yeah, no. Okay, so just like that. Put another one, another one, another one. There, there. And then one more right here. And I so said, you don't, you can keep it empty. You can put actual cobblestone there. It doesn't matter. But you just light that right there, and you're good to go. So. I need a flint and steel. But given the actual time of this episode, we will stop it here. And in the next episode, we will enter the nether. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let me know what you think. Later.